hi and welcome uh, i hope you are good uh, in this video i'll talk about how to install tensorflow in anaconda on on windows uh, now this could be any windows windows 10 windows 11 windows server uh, for this demo i'm using windows server but uh, the uh, code uh, to install tensorflow uh, would remain the same so let's start with uh, step one mm -hmm. Uh, that is to create a new conda environment now i would advise that if you are um, going to install tensorflow and work on it better create a virtual environment first and then install tensorflow so though so we'll, we'll follow these steps as i have mentioned you can follow along and uh, i have put few line a few lines of code just to test whether the tensorflow yeah, is being imported properly and we are able to uh, run the code using different modules of tensorflow creating a simple neural network uh, so let's start with this one open anaconda prompt as administrator so anaconda now for you if you are using windows 10 or windows 11 this interface would be a little different uh, it will uh, the search bar would come at the bottom left let's run the first code first line now in this conda create hyphen hyphen name env underscore deep learning now this is the environment name this you can use of your choice uh, i'm just i'm just calling it env underscore deep learning so okay paste why okay now our environment is created now the next step is to activate this uh, environment this is also very important now once we have activated our environment we'll go ahead and install tensorflow i'm using this command uh, there is a command like conda install tensorflow as well uh, but i'm using this one because i've seen this to work properly in the first time this basically will install a lower version of uh, tensorflow but uh, it works most for most of the cases just to see that which version of uh, anaconda sorry which version of tensorflow will get, will get installed we go to this code line this uh, link and for windows it's windows 1.14 if we want a, a, a higher version of tensorflow we can just put tensorflow equal to equal to let's say 2.5 but I'm, I'm just uh, installing the base version which is whichever is available so that uh, it works smoothly so we see that it's getting installed this might take few minutes be patient while installing it tensorflow that's very important I'll let it, uh, I will let it uh, finish installation. I'm not pausing it. I think it's almost done. Okay, so TensorFlow is installed. Let's see whether it, it got installed. I'll just Python. So the Python version that got installed is 3.7.12. Now, it, if we want a specific version of Python, we can just put Python equal to uh, 3.8.5, let's say. I'll tell you in a while, just, uh, but let's follow the default one right now. So import tensorflow as df so 
just give me a warning, it's fine. I'll just, okay, so import TensorFlow as TF. Okay, so it's it's working. I'll just to quit. It it is giving some messages there. Something might will get removed or deprecated. It's fine. So now to run this code, I have put it in Jupyter Notebook. There are a few other libraries that we would need, like TensorFlow, Matplotlib. Uh, so let's install those as well, so that I can open this in Jupyter in this environment. taking a bit more time okay so Jupyter is installed I'll just install matplotlib also because I want to show some plots If you want, you can install pandas. You want, uh, you can install scikit-learn. It's not needed in the code, but I'll just put it. If you want, you can install those as well. Yes. One thing I would advise is, if you are using conda to install, just use conda. If you are using pip, then just use pip. Don't mix both of them. It would, it's a recipe of disaster if you keep mixing both of them okay so now everything that that we needed to run this uh, these set of uh, codes are installed i hope uh, and then now let's open uh, this notebook and i'll show i'll run them one by one Peter notebook Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, just a I'll pause for a moment. Okay, so we are into this folder and now I'll do Jupyter Notebook. I'll just clear this. Clear this. Jupyter Notebook. Now I created an environment. I have installed all the required uh, modules, TensorFlow, Matplotlib, Jupyter to open, open Jupyter Notebook. So now let's see if we can run the commands that I have put in. Okay, so I'll start with this command. So basically this is uh, a set of code to perform handwritten digit recognition. Uh, and uh, I had run this, this uh, set of codes and I'm just rerunning it. Some things will get changed. I'll just clear the kernel. Okay. 
dot clear output okay now let's see i think this second line might not work but let's see okay it ran it's fine this is the warning warning message okay so tensorflow version is 1.140 and keras version is 2.2.4 let's keep running all the code running we are not getting any error okay first plot I'm not explaining the code, it's uh, just to check whether a previously written code is working fine or not. Which is supposed to run a deep learning model, basically classification model in TensorFlow. This does the model training. Some warnings. What is a warning? With the D type int with D type is deprecated and will be removed in a future version okay so if you want to install a future version future version of tensorflow just put equal to equal to the version number that is anything for example a 2.5 dot zero etc okay so this ran now there is another plot for accuracy and Validation score, okay. Okay, there is one change with the older version because this code was written for a newer version, but this a little bit changed, like some few things are a little bit different. So this is just plotted. So this is the summary. Open Anaconda prompt as administrator. Uh, Conda create hyphen hyphen name deep learning for, for us. It's, it was uh, env underscore deep learning. Activate deep learning. Env underscore deep learning. Conda install hyphen c forge Conda hyphen forge tensorflow. And then install the remaining uh, dependencies as well like uh, matplotlib or Jupyter, but this will install the TensorFlow for you. Uh, before ending, I just want to tell one more thing. In case, let's say you want a higher version of Python or and higher version of TensorFlow, then you can just use use this command: conda create hyphen hyphen name deep learning or env underscore deep learning python equal to 3.8.5. This will install the Python version of your choice. If you don't know your Python version, then just run this. And if you want a specific version of TensorFlow, either you use this command, conda install TensorFlow equal to equal to 2.5.0, or this one. They, they both will install the same, same thing when you are mentioning the Python uh, TensorFlow version. Uh, now this you would use if you know what version of uh, Python and TensorFlow you want to install. Otherwise, just follow this these three lines of code that will be sufficient for you so this completes the video i hope you will be able to install tensorflow and use it successfully uh, that's all from my side thank you take care